What a beautiful day to learn in school. And what are you learning today? Ah, the basic emotions. Pops, shall we go over them again? Joyful, when a big smile is drawn on our faces. <laughs> Sad, if we can't help crying. Fearful, when we open our eyes and mouth wide. Scared. <laughs> Angry, if we frown and pout. <laughs> Thanks, Pops. Children, did you learn them? Very, very well. Great then. The task for tomorrow is to bring a picture of every emotion learned today. Joyful, sad, fearful, and angry. The garden is a good place to take pictures, don't you think, kids? Great choice, Phoebe. The photo will have a beautiful background. Hey, Groovy, you are finally going to fulfill your dream of being a model. Pose for us. <laughs> All right. Now pretend you're super happy. Hey, you don't look really happy. Let's try better with sadness. Come on, Groovy. It's going to be more difficult than I thought. Pops has an idea to make the photos work. Provoke Groovy's emotions. But shh, it's better that Groovy doesn't know. What a scary pose, Groovy. Perfect picture. You already have one emotion, fear. Let's continue with the next one. Hmm. That broccoli looks great. How happy Groovy is. Oh no, it wasn't for you, Groovy. You're so sad. Great! Two emotions and one to go. Joy and sadness. We only have one left to complete the album. Oh no, the camera is broken! There is the missing emotion, anger. What a pity that we can't take a picture of Phoebe, but what about a drawing? Yes, you can draw anger in the album directly. What's the matter? Don't you have something to draw with? I see. Groovy, can you help us? Children, what should Groovy transform into to draw on the album? A pearl necklace? A marker? Or a rugby ball? Yes, into a marker. Great.
It's fantastic, Phoebe. The album is full. Homework done. You can play now. Oh, an A+. Plus. That's really something to be cheerful about, kids. Let's see those smiles. Cheer up, Groovy. You'll end up doing it well. What a beautiful day to play with all these toys. Groovy, watch out! <laughs> what a crash! Oh, what's wrong with Phoebe? Kids, could you tell me? How does Phoebe feel? Joyful? Fearful? Angry? Or sad? That's it. Phoebe is sad. Nice try. Oh, Phoebe must be very sad not to laugh with you. Groovy, it's okay if Phoebe's sad. Emotions aren't bad. They help us to know what we are feeling. We need to find out why Phoebe's sad. What's the matter, Phoebe? Why are you sad? Oh no, Snuggles is gone. Now we understand why Phoebe feels so sad. Snuggles is her pet, and she loves him very much. Wait a minute, but Snuggles always leaves for a while. But you're worried because he hasn't come back yet. How long has he been gone? Don't worry, Phoebe. We're going to help you find him. Phoebe, have you looked around already? And the rest of the garden? Yes, the garden is very big and Snuggles is very small. We need help to find him quickly. Groovy, can you help us? Children, what should Groovy transform into to find Snuggles? A toy truck? A helicopter? Or a slipper? Exactly! Into a helicopter! Great! There he 
is where the roses are. He's stuck in the fence. Oh, so much love. How beautiful. I love stories with a happy ending. Phoebe has gone from being sad to joyful thanks to our friendship. Yay! Haha, <laughs> <laughs> Snuggles is having a great time. And Groovy, too! Skeleton Finger, Skeleton Finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Zombie Finger, Zombie Finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Which finger, which finger, where day for learning at school. There you go. Groovy, it looks great on you. It will make you look even cuter in the group photo you're taking today. time. How elegant. It's going to be a beautiful picture. Oh, 
You too, Phoebe. There's something weird going on here. Groovy, let me look. Oh no, lice! Guys, guys, it's okay. Having lice is normal, but we must stop them quickly. Pop will explain to us how to do it. Lice and their eggs are parasites. That is, they live in your head, rent-free, paying nothing. They like clean hair, even if you wash every day. You can still have them. They spread very fast. You have to stop them immediately. How? with an anti-lice shampoo. And if the problem persists, with a special comb. Here we go. Wow, there's lots of them. And they want to keep spreading through the heads of all of the kids. Come on, we must hurry. The lice are already jumping. Oh no, this is getting out of hand. We've got to do something now. Nice try, Groovy, but they're jumping too much. Good thinking, Groovy, but they're so fast, they're already on every head. And now they also want to conquer the professor's head. Yes, it's lice. Guys, we have to do something before the whole school is overrun with lice. Shall we try the good stuff first? Maybe we can try to convince them to leave. We must try it. Mr. Louse, we come in peace. Please leave our heads. We can give you lots of gifts like these in return. Oh yeah? Well, if diplomacy doesn't work, we'll take action. They wanted it. This is a job for Super Groovy and Super Phoebe. What's on your mind, Groovy? What do you think Groovy has to become to get rid of lice? An electric guitar? Knit shampoo? Or a teaspoon? Yes, it's shampoo. We want you out of our heads. Now let's shampoo the children as well. Good job, Groovy. It seems it's working.
Guys, they're leaving. Congratulations. Let's see if we can now take the group photo. Smile. Let's say lice. Oh no, these lice are heavy. What a beautiful day to play in the garden. <laughs> What's the matter, Phoebe? Tired of the ball already? Ah, you want to try Groovy Scooter. It's okay. Let's ask him if he'll let you have it for a while. Groovy! 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 <laughs> Hi, Groovy! Could you lend your scooter to Phoebe for a ride? Come on, she really wants to play with it for a while. That's it, Groovy! There's nothing better than knowing how to share with your friends. Wow, Phoebe has taken a liking to the scooter. Don't worry, Groovy. We are asking her to return it to you right now. Phoebe, Phoebe, Phoebe. Now it's Groovy's turn to use the scooter. Phoebe, that's not done. You have to share your toys. It's Groovy's turn. Pops, please tell her yourself to see if she listens to you better. Sharing toys with your friends is so much fun. But sharing doesn't only mean that they lend you their toys. You should lend them yours too. Don't be selfish. This way, both of you will win because you will have many more toys to play with together. Did you get that, Phoebe? Phoebe, that's not very nice. Ruby, you better play something else. How about some tea time with your little friends? I think Mr. Teddy wants a little more. What's the matter, Phoebe? Tired of the skateboard? Do you want to play tea party? You'll have to talk to Groovy first. You weren't very nice to him before. What, Groovy? Should we let Phoebe play? Run, Groovy! She's taking your guests! Oh, oh, Phoebe, you're stuck in the treehouse now. Only Groovy can help you, but since you haven't been very nice to him, I don't know if he'll want to. What do we do, Groovy? Do we help her? Yeah, I know. Phoebe loves all of your toys and hasn't wanted to share them with you. But still, Phoebe's your friend, and that's the most important thing. Don't you think we should help her? Kids, what should Groovy transform into so Phoebe can get down from the tree? A boat? A shampoo bottle? Or a rescue mattress? Yes, into a mattress! Hey, 
Hey, Yay. come on, Phoebe. You just have to jump. Good. Where's Phoebe? Where is she? Ah, there she is. Phoebe, don't you think Groovy deserves an apology? I'm glad to see you two finally playing together. There's nothing more fun than sharing games and toys with friends. Right, Mr. Teddy? <laughs> wow, Groovy! You look really handsome today! But what are those buttons? One has a nice smiley face on it. And the other a bad and angry one. But don't press them. It has a don't touch sign on it. No, Groovy! Wow! Is it a magic mirror? The reflection shows an even nicer and sweeter Groovy! Oh, he's so cute! <laughs> what happened? Wow, Phoebe accidentally hit the mirror, but she hit the red button! What's going to happen now? Oh no! Now the reflection shows an evil Groovy! What's he gonna do? Groovy, be careful! Oh no! Now Groovy's trapped in the mirror, and his evil version is out to play tricks! What can we do? Groovy is red because it's not groovy. You see, there was a magic mirror with a don't touch sign on it, and then Groovy and I were playing, and we pressed a red button, and now Groovy is trapped inside. And this evil Groovy is out. Look out, he's running away. That's it, Groovy. That was fast. What a team. to behave well and not to disobey again. Look, Groovy! A blue jelly! Mmm! Delicious! Blue! <laughs> Groovy, now you're blue! Those fresh fruit ice creams look really good. Delicious. Mmm, Phoebe's ice cream has two strawberry balls and Groovy's one, two, three, four, five balls of different fruit. So greedy. Be careful, Groovy. Oh, too bad. Haha, <laughs> Groovy. It's not the wave's fault. Groovy, that's Phoebe's ice cream. She has to decide if she wants to share it with you or not. Very good, Phoebe. 
you should always share with your friends. Now you can both enjoy your fresh and healthy ice cream. Mmm. Nom. And now, keep enjoying the beach with friends. Oh no! I lost my color! 